James, my good friend James Spears is implementing his, uh, the new Ryobi tools to what he's already been doing. So, uh, So today what we're going to do is we're, I'm actually, I'm actually going to my friend's house. Uh, he got a new space for his, uh, for something he does on the side. You know, he builds costumes and, uh, like I said in previous videos, he implemented, uh, Ryo, his, uh, Ryobi products to replace products that he used to use be because of the OnePlus system. So what we're actually doing over there is, uh, customizing his new space so today what we're gonna do is gonna go to his his place and we're gonna uh, we're gonna start doing some demo work we're going to install new lights paint a little bit and uh, and just do a little bit of planning on what might need to be done so it's gonna be fun I already have some uh, some of my tools over there uh, so I need a few more items so we can work better uh and so yeah so we're, we're gonna uh grab those right now put them in the car then pretty much uh head on over there i will need i'll need the light because we gotta turn off the power to replace some light so we will need that i haven't used this one in a long time but the you know you have the power so use the power you know what, just in case, why not have extra light? Brand nail, just in case. I know he has one, but I'm not sure if he's going to bring it, just in case. I think I'll need, with the batteries that I already have there, I'll just put this in here. That'll be done. We have drill bits already. I'm going to use this impact driver, haven't used it in a while. Oh, and what I do plan on doing in the future for this uh, for this impact driver, I want to replace the anvil inside and get the quarter inch hex out. I want to put a uh, three eighths inch anvil in there, so I just put a socket on that. So we will be for uh, some of these tools, we will be taking out uh, taking some of these apart to customize it so that's that is in future videos the oxidized ones no that one's good we'll take this all right so we are here at my buddy james house we are installing a new light fixture and we put a dimmer switch on over there and so Yes, yeah, so we have uh, the Ryobi LED lights helping us out with our work area. We got the radio going, all battery operated. So yes, this is what our goal is. So let's see how long this takes us. One down, 30 to go. So what we did, let's see if we can dim that down. Good, we did, we put a, what size is this? Uh, a quarter inch uh, hex on there. Instead of just using a regular Phillips head, we're using this one and it's just driving that right on it. Yeah. 
Boom! I love this light. This light is seriously awesome. It helps out in every situation when you have no power and it lights up everything and not just a little area. This light does wonders. see this one here we got a little head start so we got uh, mark 17 heartbreaker is got the legs and the torso already assembled uh, this isn't a full body you know body effigy this is just uh, more of a display frame so it's reason it doesn't look like it's really uh, kind of all together Let's not tell people that we cannibalized a suit to sell it to a client. <laughs>
As you can see, we are working on my friend's new uh, craft space, if you want to call it craft space. What my friend's been doing for the past couple years, I'd say probably like seven or eight years, he's been building uh, costumes out of foam. And so the new line of Ryobi is actually helping him able to do that easier and better than ever. So, so yes, he's excited. Uh, I'm excited. We're both excited about his new space. He is, he did make a YouTube channel. It's called Foam Club. He also uh, made a Facebook group called Foam Club, you know, which both of us build costumes, but I just build it in a certain way. Uh, I just build it differently. I still will be, when I make the, you guys seen this before, uh, this is the chest piece, a chest piece to uh, my halo suit. Uh, I build mine out of paper, which uh, which requires me to do sanding, use Dremel stuff and, and stuff like that. But this process, it's it's a pain in the butt doing it like this. I What I really should be doing is learn how to build it out of foam because it's it's easier it's faster it's lighter when you wear it but uh but yes we are as you can see we're just we just started working on his new uh new workspace and we're going to uh make it perfect for what he needs it for and we're gonna do it with our ryobi tools I don't need to bring as much Ryobi tools next time because we, we both forgot that he actually has the Ryobi tools too. Hang on. So yes, uh, I think that's it. I got batteries on charge. I got a few more to put on charge in a little bit. And uh, this is Dave and Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in and I'll see you guys next time.